Hey everybody, Arclight here. Welcome back. We're gonna be starting a new playthrough. We're gonna be playing another Bad Dream game, but this time it's Bad Dream Fever. And I haven't played this one yet. It's kind of new, but not really. Anyway, I've been gone for a long time. I've I've had a huge hiatus, and I am back, and I am ready to put out some more content. So we're gonna start with this nice little horror game, and uh, it's a horror point and click, and we're gonna see where it takes us. We're gonna start here, and I've got other things that I want to do. I want to put out more Monster Seed, but unfortunately, I lost a lot of my footage, so I'm gonna have to go back and uh, re-record a little bit. Uh, I'll probably have to skip over a just one big fight in the game, which is not really that big a deal. I'm still gonna go through and show like the areas and all that, but it's a pain in the ass that I lost the footage, so I, I was kind of discouraged to continue that playthrough. But now that uh, now that I'm back doing this again, I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna jump back into it soon. So look out for that and some other stuff. I'm gonna try to upload at least two videos a week. I'm gonna shoot for three, but I can't promise anything. All right, nothing like two little feet in a in a bedroom. Am I supposed to be? Oop. Turn that TV on. The fuck is that? All right. Very good. Bad dream fever. Welcome. Yeah, here we go. Another bad dream. Some people would call those nightmares. All right. Um, pretty normal, except for this weird cat skull down here. Oh, nice. Oh, look in here. Doesn't seem to be anything... Oh, wait. That cord is really dark now. Doesn't seem to be anything useful in there. Am I supposed to be... Oh, the door's locked. Okay, so first thing we gotta do is get the fuck out of our bedroom. Why are we locked in our bedroom? And is there seriously gonna be a key to get out of here? I don't know. It's a nightmare. It doesn't have to make sense, right? Okay, glad I looked at that. Doesn't seem to be. Oh. You just knock on everything? Knock on the door? No. Everything but the door. I can knock on everything but the door. What is this bullshit? Why is the window boarded up? Come on, there's gotta be something we can use in here. Eight, no. No, 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 no. Oh, it's a key, okay. So, let's uh, let's use that on the door, shall we? Do I right click? I, I do, I right click. Okay, so now our bedroom goes out into this room, which is not <laughs> normal by any means. Oh yeah, very good. Um, Spray paint? I don't I don't know what that is. Huh. Uh are all these doors locked? All with the bedroom door. Okay. Ain't that some shit. Oh, can't turn that on. What's this? Whoa, that falls right out. Knob. A, a knob for what? I don't know. Knob from the lock. Okay, but where 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 would I use a knob at? I, like, I just like clicking on things to hear the noises. Ooh, there's bugs coming out of that box. I think I got them all out. Yep.
Okay, so let's see this knob. Yeah. Do I drag it? I don't drag it. What? What the fuck? Can I use something to put that, keep that in place? Eight? No. Spray paint? Great. Oh wait, how about this? Yes. Okay, I'm trying to figure out what, how, how we use items in this. Okay. What? still falls off. I've got glue, but it's not helping. What else could we possibly need? The fuck? What in the world? Why did that happen? So we literally did have to wait for time to pass. Oh, hi. Yuck, for the moment I advise you to not go through this door. That shocking view and repulsive smell, just at the thought of it, I feel nauseous. I'm wearing a mask and still it's hard for me to bear this terrible odor. Everything is dripping a dark, sticky slime, which stench can cause vomiting. Gross. Okay, who are you? I said to a complete stranger just after leaving the toilet, I had in mind the exit door. You see, a whole new type of plague has appeared in the world. Terrible dark blue ink has filled the bodies of all the city's residents. I don't think anyone survived. Human bodies are decaying and rotting in the streets. For now, there's no medicine or vaccine. I'm trying to figure out the situation. If you want, you can help me stop this gruesome virus. I think that together we would have greater chances to survive. You can't go out, however, without preparation. Search my room thoroughly. You are sure to find some useful objects there. And about the toilet. For the time being, I don't advise going in, in there. Okay. Hello. Oops. Forgive me this mess. Well, but it's not that bad. At least almost everything is in plain view. There's definitely something here that can be useful for us. Who are you, lady? Um, what could possibly be useful? Unfortunately, you have to get used to the view of death. Corpses outside have a lot of rotting, smelly meat on them. What's worse, they are dripping with slimy ink. In comparison to them, this skull looks quite good. It is just lying there innocently on the pillow as if it was reading a book. Anyway, it does not matter. Click on the objects that could at least have some small sense. We are looking for something that could be helpful on the outside. Socks. Do you remember what I said? Click on the object if it makes some sense. But a dirty women's sock is of little use. It makes a poor weapon or protection. What about this? Can I take this? Sigh. That I'd have to hang- I don't know why I read sigh. <sighs> is that better? <sighs> That I'd have to hang around with a stuffed toy. I don't I don't know what that means. It is just as uncommunicative as the people on the outside, but it smells much better. Okay. I don't see anything particularly useful in your room. No offense, but there's nothing in here. Oh, great! The walkie-talkie guarantees us a permanent source of contact. Listening to my advice, you'll deal with all the adversities that you'll encounter during your adventures. You just need to put in a battery and we'll test the equipment. I will go look for the second walkie-talkie. I think I saw it somewhere in the workshop. 
Okay. Is there a battery? Yeah, there's a battery right here. I got it. Okay. He's got it too. There was a problem. Found the second walkie-talkie, but unfortunately it does not work. I check what is the matter with it, but I recently put cream on my hands. Can you take care of it? I guess. Looks like you have to unscrew the screws in the lid. Okay. I'll take this. These wires probably remember the last century. They practically fell apart in your hand. No wonder that walkie-talkie couldn't pick up a signal. It's high time to replace them with new ones. Spare wires are in one of the boxes. Only I don't remember which one. Okay. Those boxes are empty. Okay. Well. What about that box? What about here? What's this? That's not a wire I can use. about this box? Not, it is rather not this box. Okay. Nope. Uh, I'm gonna check this one. Oh! There we go. Spiders? Do something about them. The hell do I do about spiders? Get off me. Jeez, okay. Although there are still infected rats, mutant crocodiles, bloodthirsty vulture birds, many species survived. The current ecosystem favors the development of various scavengers. It's quite exciting to observe. You probably can't wait to go outside and see it with your own eyes. I don't really want to, but I guess we don't really have a choice. So let's put this bad boy in there. And, uh, oh, I guess we're gluing it. Okay. Stick that back in. How about, how about that? Great, you did it! Finally, you're ready to go outside. It's about goddamn time. Uh, time to say goodbye for now. Contact me as soon as you're outside. Be careful. Okay. Oh boy. Are we outside? You're outside of my hiding place for a few minutes and I already lost my patient. I'm guessing what's, what you're clicking. God, what the fuck? Like, I feel like, I feel like your sentences don't make a lot of sense the way you're saying them, lady. And it's confusing me because I want to like reconstruct them in my head to make sense, but they don't make sense all the time. You must check that I'll be able to observe your actions. Only this way I can be useful. Ooh. Okay. Well, do you see a video camera around here? Cause I fucking don't. Oh, that's cute. Oh. I don't think you understand the situation. You should avoid contact with ink at all costs. Don't click on the infected at the first possible opportunity. Camera might prove helpful. Thanks to it, I could see what you were doing. As I say, two heads are better than one. Huh. Oh. Look for something that I can use to reach the camera without endangering my health. Can I just click on all the ink? One y'all got an umbrella or something? I need an umbrella. Oh, look at that guy. I like him. Can't go that way. Cute. X marks the spot. I got a beam. Why do I have a beam? I don't know. Uh, 
I see. Got it. I was able to lift the camera, for sure. There is some progress. It's a shame that I still can't see anything. Oh well, you'll need to continue searching this location on your own. Without a doubt, you'll find something else here that would be useful. When you are done searching, I invite you to my workshop. We'll diagnose what is wrong with this camera. Okay. Maybe there's something in here after all. I don't see anything particularly useful. What do we have here? A blue ink. I don't I don't see anything that could be of any use whatsoever. Okay. All right. Hello? Ah, oh, it's you. It's great that you are calling, but next time simply use your walkie-talkie. I hear you perfectly on it. I don't see anything else useful, man. Wants me to get something else useful. I see nothing of the sort. <coughs> what? <coughs> oh. Interesting. Why is that? That doll shouldn't be alive, dude. Okay, so I can go via the map, but there's no- where's the map? Map? There's no map. Um... How do I- How do I pull up the map? How do I do it? Oh, there it is. Bus stop. I'm assuming this is you, lady? Okay, we're here. Nice to see that you managed to stay alive. <laughs> Thank you. This is a good sign. Yeah, I would say it's a good sign. Please give me what you found. Oh, the camera. Yeah, here you go. Let's see. In contrast to the walkie-talkie, the wires are fine. Parts look good. That's strange. Seemingly everything is in order. I think something like a cassette needs to go inside it. I'm almost certain that I saw something like that at home. Can you help me look? I'll take a look around. The desk at which I sit. You know what? I've seen that. But I'm going to end this episode here. So this is a weird first look at this game. Uh, nothing really that creepy except for a crying doll has been found so far. Um, it's just weird so far. And we got this lady with a plague mask. Um, I don't know. I don't know. We're going to continue on with this in the next episode. See where it takes us. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Do what you guys do best. And I will see you guys again in the next episode. Bye-bye.